Hi everyone, now I'll share the life story of Dr. B.R. Ambedkar. A celebrated hero, Dr. B.R. Ambedkar was born on 14th April 1891 in a family of Harijans. In his school days, he faced inequality. Very much that he was highly discriminated for his low caste birth. He and his friends were treated as untouchables and were not allowed to experience the same as the other high caste groups in the society. They were excluded, separated, and Ambedkar and his friends bade the inhuman treatment throughout his childhood. Later, he moved to England for his higher studies. Then he came back to India and was appointed as the signing secretary at Baroda. Still, the racial discrimination kept on. Therefore, he left the job and moved to Bombay to practice law. But there also he was constantly facing humiliation and exploitive practices towards him. He continued his life as a social worker, a writer and an educationist. He always worked towards abolishing the practice of untouchability. He stood up for the rights of the poor and those belonging to the lower castes. In 1930, Ambedkar represented the untouchables community at the Roundtable Conference and was successful at securing Harijan's reserved seats in the elections and in various other sectors. B.R. Ambedkar founded the Independent Labour Party in 1936. He was Free India's first law minister who was also the chairman of the drafting committee of Indian Constitution. He became the chairman of the Constitution on 29th August 1947. He was known for legislating the reservation bill for the members of the lower classes and tribes in government job civil services education and other factors of the society. He studied the constitutions of various countries and gathered their key points and assimilated them into Indian constitution. Ambedkar believed that it is very important to have unity in the country among various classes of the society. Therefore, he focused on gender, caste and religion equality in the nation. He was a true son of Mother India and this is the reason he was honoured with Bharat Ratna. He became a Buddhist during the last days of his life. Since 1948, Ambedkar suffered from diabetes in 1954. He faced clinical depression and eyesight issues due to which he was on the bed from June to October. On 6 December 1956, Ambedkar died while sleeping in his home in Delhi. People started worshipping him like a god. In his entire life, Ambedkar fought for the upliftment of untouchables and other weaker sections of the society. That's why it's an important reason why people still worship him like a god. Bhim Rao Ramji Ambedkar the man who is popularly known as the father of Indian constitution is one of the greatest leaders who advocated the principles of equality of speech and socio-economic justice for the oppressed sections of the society in India. And this is a brief life story of Bhim Rao Ramji Ambedkar.